Diaz is three years his senior. He is two inches taller. He will have a six inch reach advantage. All right, now for the particulars, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Mario Yamasaki. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC welterweight division. This is the first fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a jiu-jitsu fighter, holding a professional record of 20 wins, 11 losses. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of Stockton, California, ladies and gentlemen, an ultimate fighter season winner, Ned Diaz! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a grappler, holding a professional record of 26 wins, no losses. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of the Republic of Dagestan, Russia, Habiba the Evil Imagomedov! All right, I gave instructions to you guys in the locker room. I want you guys to follow my orders at all times. Defend yourself at all times. Touch gloves. Good luck. All right, here we go. I am fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming, and they're finally going to get after it. There we go. First round, you ready? Are you ready? And Let's we go. are underway. So here is the inimitable Nate Diaz, more than 10 years on this UFC roster. And here's a guy who intimidates a lot of opponents before they even make the walk tonight. Things could get really interesting. That hammer fist attempt is blocked. Look at that. Nice. Side control. Working from the mounted crucifix. Excellent movement here on the ground. Transitions to full guard. He's got a guillotine. That choke looks locked up tight. He might get a finish here. This is getting tighter. He can There's tap any top. second. Great job. Didn't waste any time. Took this fight to the ground and got the early submission. Well, yeah, Joe, that was fun while it lasted. He told us he wanted to be at his most efficient here tonight. He certainly didn't waste a lot of time. He knew he wanted to get the fight to the ground. He gets the early takedown, and the submission follows shortly thereafter. And here's the end of the fight. Let's see it again here. Deep guillotine choke, full guard for the tap. And finally, one more time, no choice but to tap. So there he is, your winner by submission. That is a finish they will likely be talking about for some time. Big win, major statement made to the rest of this division. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki has called a stop to this contest at one minute, 37 seconds of the very first round. He the winner by tap out, Nate Diaz! All right, so another big win for Nate Diaz here tonight, and I think more importantly, this sets him up for a massive opportunity now moving forward, perhaps even a title shot at 155 pounds. Nate Diaz has made a career of defying the odds, rising to the occasion, and he certainly did that tonight in a matchup that people thought maybe was stacked against him. So congratulations to Nate Diaz. You can be sure they are celebrating it.